Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we are here with episode 9 of The Bad Batch season 2. I am very excited but also a little bit nervous for this episode because we uh, we no longer have Echo and I'm kind of sad about that. As happy as I am that he's away off with Rex, I am still kind of sad that like if we're just focusing on The Bad Batch, I'm sad that we're not going to get to see him because uh, I love him. So um, I don't know whether we're going to go along with his journey in this episode or whether we're going to go to the back to the Bad Batch. Um, either way, I'm excited, so let's get into the episode. Are we listening to sad music because we've lost Echo? <laughs> Is that what's going on? It's so sad without him, man. Come back to us, Echo. This planet looks pretty fucking cool, if I'm honest. I don't know if I'd want to be here, but... Hello. You look cool. You're probably going to be a burden, but you look cool. She misses Echo. Yeah. They had to lose Crosshair and now they've lost Echo. In a very different circumstance, but... Yeah. But must be precise. Damn, Ipsium is pretty. I feel like we're going to hear an explosion at some point. This looks like a child. What is it, Hunter? A ship! This looks like a ship. Tell me, Rekka. How exactly did you miss our ship being compromised? Maybe if you had it out of view, I would have seen someone approaching. Yeah. There was no other suitable landing zone. Perhaps we can acquire. No, they've got Gonky. That would take. Well, since we do not That's not very good, is it? Long range communications without our ship. He's too long range. Echo won't pick up our signal. Especially since he disabled his communication device. What? Why? I assume he's on a sensitive mission. Ah, uh, do we get to see that sensitive mission? Ryan grumbling. Oh my god, it's a bloater. What's that? Not what I expected. I love them. Oh, I love them so much. Damn. That was a lot of them. But they're pretty cute. I want to see them up close. So, now we are trapped. And we have lost all of our Ipsium. Well, that's great. I, I suppose that's my fault too. No. Well, technically, yes. Okay. If you had not let our ship get stolen, we would be aboard it right now with the Oh, leave him be. None of this is helping. Well, then how are we going <laughs> to The ship's not important right now. We need to yeah, Wrecker, you wiki roar at them. You tell them who's boss. It is most unlikely that the Marauder will be recovered. But Gonky! Don't say that! Marauder's our home! We already lost Echo! We can't lose that too! And her little plushie! Omega, we didn't lose Echo. He's not here! And I he's, want him back! He's not with us! I'm with Omega on this. supposed to be a squad! What is your issue? Heck, my boy, you need to get better at learning emotions, reading emotions, understanding. You know, maybe walking off alone might not be a good idea in this place. Oh, I just want to give her a hug, though. Is that more Ipsium? Oh my god, is it going to be like a whole cave full of it? Wow. Damn, that's a lot. This feels like Lord of the Rings and they're looking for Mithril. <laughs> I 
I should say rings of power specifically. Oh, bless his heart. He means well. He really does. He's just a little bit not great at reading emotions, which is fine. Because it's him. <laughs> Perks of neurodivergence, my dudes. <laughs> Heck, it's our neurodivergent king. Then you better not distract me. Oh! Shit! Our way through the cave then. Look how mature she's getting. <laughs> oh no. Omega. Uh, it's not worth it. Take. Omega. Peck's gonna go back to the others and be like, hey, I kind of lost the child. Well, thank God there's water down there. Jesus Christ. Has anyone ever taught her how to swim? It's the fact these guys have no idea what the fuck's going on. Something's wrong. His clone senses are tingling. Wow, that's pretty. But we are alive. Uh, yes. <laughs> is a good question. I mean, I wouldn't mind staying there and looking at the water, because that's really pretty. I hate this planet! <laughs> this cavern in short order once they arrive with the mineral. We are more than that. Yeah, you're... We you're... family. Oh, you're family! Aren't we? Yeah. Well, yes, of course we are. Then why don't you act like it? He cares in his own way. I may process moments and thoughts differently, but it does not mean that I feel any less than you. Why am I getting emotional, bro? What the fuck? <laughs> and then I started blasting. Pew pew. Precise, it will cause another cave in. Sorry, Wrecker, not this time, buddy. You can blow up the next thing. So, how the fuck are we gonna get off this planet? Maybe the guy feels bad and brings the ship back, and he's like, I saw you had a pet gonk, so I'm gonna bring him back to you. You'll have to figure it out yourself. Sid, you sent us on. I'm still in two minds about Sid. I don't know if I like her or not. Just like, like ugh. helped you regain control of your parlor from Roland Durand. And when we cleared your sizable debt with Malay. I didn't ask for a recap goggles. <laughs> I mean you kinda needed it. They've done a lot for you. Alright. Give me a few days and I'll see what I can do. We don't have a few days. What do we do now? This bitch? Dude, the thunder looks cool. The lightning, that looks sick. Alright, and there we have it for this episode of The Bad Batch. I thought it was a fun episode. Uh, I thought the scenery and everything on the planet was very pretty. Uh, I'm still very worried about Gonky, I'm gonna be honest. Gonky is my main priority right now, is worrying about where he is, who he's with, what's gonna happen to him. Uh, so I really hope that we get the ship back. Uh, that would be quite nice. Um, no idea who Sid is going to send to help get us off the planet. I wonder if it's going to be someone we know or if it's going to be somebody new or what what's going to happen. So I am excited for next week's episode. Um, let me know what you guys thought of this episode and I will see you guys in the next video. So peace and may the force be with you.